It's not every day one of the country's top college hockey programs lets go of a winning head coach, but that is the case today at the University of Michigan. Mel Pearson will not get a new contract after an investigation found he contributed to a toxic culture within the hockey program, including encouraging players to lie about COVID-19. Priya Mann with more tonight from Ann Arbor. He was a familiar face here at Yost Ice Arena as head coach for five seasons. But after facing mounting pressure today, U of M announced Mel Pearson will not be returning. I think he deserved it, and I think I think it was coming for a long time. On Friday, it was official. Mel Pearson's contract with U of M will not be renewed. I know it's not a good thing for any team, any, any uh, university. Uh, to have anything bad going on like that, but uh, I, I think it was the right decision. The former Michigan Wolverines head coach was accused of retaliating against student athletes who raised concerns about the culture of the hockey program. He was also accused of pressuring students to lie on COVID-19 tracing forms and creating a toxic environment for female staff members. I mean, it's good that he's gone finally, but I don't like that. It took so long. Last year, a former U of M goalie filed a complaint claiming Pearson fired him for reporting the allegations. U of M then hired an independent firm to review the climate and culture of its hockey program. The report found Pearson lied to investigators. In a statement, Director of Athletics Ward Manuel wrote, our student athletes having a positive and meaningful experience is of paramount importance and a clear expectation within our department is that all employees and staff are valued and supported. I deeply appreciate appreciate and value the many individuals who came forward throughout this review. The Michigan hockey team is talented enough in itself where whichever coach that they have, they can work with to still succeed. It's Michigan, I'm sure they'll, they'll, they'll bounce back. And under Pearson, the last season, the Michigan Wolverines had their most wins since 2007. An interim head coach has not yet been announced. Of course, we'll keep you posted as soon as we hear. Reporting live tonight, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Yeah, all right, Priya, thanks.